What is happening? YouTube Cowboy here, and we have one more video before we head to the Hissing Wastes with the Cradle of Sullivan. So let's head on over, see what this place is all about. This was one of the uh, War Table missions that we unlocked. So I have high expectations. They're usually... Anytime you unlock something off the War Table, it's usually a really fun mission. So hopefully it's pretty cool. Find out in just a second here. Once we get past the brutal load screens, the game is so well known for. Discovered hollowed passageway. So the ruined blade, four pieces to recover. Stuck it in the arse end of nowhere. All I know is the fact that we're collecting a sword. I really hope it's like a massive two-hander that's ultra badass that I can give to Bull that he'll absolutely decimate everything with. Be swift and silent. Veer Asan, the way of the arrow. Maybe it's going to be like a puzzle and I have to like manually shoot something with an arrow, Skyrim style. Because that would be totally awesome and I would be 100% in support of that. As the sapling bends, so must you. Alright, so it's telling me to, to bend it like Beckham. What is the red? Poison spider? What the fuck? I'm like afraid to hit this thing. It's so close to that massive hole. I'm gonna fall right off. This whole area has a very, uh, kind of mysterious vibe going on. Just our light chambers, excuse me. Scatter loot throughout. I mean, considering I think this is Elvin, I can hope it's a two handed, right? There's an altar. If the elves perform some sort of magic here, we should proceed with caution, Inquisitor. Well, we're not going to be proceeding at all until we find some Veilfire, but I have a feeling that's what I need to do, is Veilfire up these little, uh, these bowls, and then stuff happens from there. So I'm pretty sure I saw two other bowls similar to that one. Yeah. There's another one. So the question is, where is the Veilfire? Aha! Vivian, dear, come light this. So, whoa! Is that a fire rune? It's a revenant. Boom! Oh, you're dead. You're dead. Don't even... Don't even attempt to fuck with this. No loot? Come on, I need revenant hearts. Bah. It's only part of the sword. The elves broke it after all. That corpse was possessed by a pride demon. No doubt drawn by the elves' use of blood magic. There must be... Pointed dual blade schematic. That's not going to be of much use. Come on, light it. I want to light these all, just in case there's... Oh my god. Vivian, can you handle this one? Thank you. So if this is as simple as, as light and... Uh, I might have zero out of four pieces collected, though. I definitely have one piece. Now this literally might be as simple as... Like, lighting four altars, and then I'm done. Another revenant. Because he thinks it's going to matter. Come on, 
You guys haven't killed it yet? Elven sword it. guard. Not with lunch. Wait a minute. Why do I have two quest things popping up? I have one that's <laughs> I have one that's saying that I'm zero out of four, and I have another one that's showing up as I collect the pieces, showing actual progress. Everyone just crap on this. I'm too busy holding the Veilfire. Water these revenants. Masterwork pommel. That's always nice. Ooh, man. Sanctuary of the dead. And there's only one more to go, so. Whoa. That was cool. You guys can just kill this real fast. I'm just going to walk past it. Once again, revenants. No chance. Really? He survived that? Oh my god. I don't know how you survived, but you won't survive this. Mark of the Rift, bitches! Give me all of your life. And this one's like extra beefy. Not gonna matter. Shatter pieces of the sword. Perhaps Dagna can find a way to restore it. Mm -hmm. Kind of just fast travel out. Oh well, we'll take the long way. Do do. Dagna, I need you to make me a super cool weapon. Is that really it for this area? Is that all that was here? Yeah, I guess so. I mean, there were a couple upstairs areas. There might be, like, some... I mean, I found the masterwork thing. That's the only thing I can think of of, of real value. There might have been another masterwork thing hidden somewhere, but... Whatever. We came for the sword. We got the sword. So, now let's hop over to Dagna, have her fix this thing up, and hopefully we get something really badass out of it. It's always a bummer when, like, you kill a dragon or you do a quest and you get a cool weapon, and it's, like, not even remotely close to the power of your crafted weapon. You're like, oh, well, you know, that's, that's cool and all, but unfortunately you're kind of garbage compared to what I can already make. So let me just sell you here. Legendary weapon that took 10 minutes to find the pieces for and craft and kill four high end revenants. I'm hoping that's not the case. Very high hopes.
I feel like the fast travel over here should just be in the Undercroft. Like, 90% of the time when I'm coming here, I'm going to the Undercroft. You know, I'm specifically heading straight there to, to either craft weapons or make some runes or change around a hilt or a pommel or whatever the case is. And it's like, you know, it, it's unnecessary to have it right at the throne for me to jump right in here. Just let me go straight to the Undercroft. That'd be so much easier. All right, Dagna. Mind your step for things, Inquisitor. We found a sword in an elven ruin. Can you do something with it? That broken thing? You can't stitch a sword. Metal doesn't heal. What if it did, though? That would be amazing. Dagna, the sword? Sorry. It's quality, right? I could use the pieces to make a plan for a new sword. One that's less broken. It's like the pieces are... inspiration. That's just perfect for you. Sullivan Blade. So, unique great sword. Ooh. Bull. 282 AoE damage, 11 armor pen, which I'm not a giant fan of, but 42 strength and then a chance to cast Pull of the Abyss on a hit. That is pretty awesome, I gotta say. How does it look? Oh, it looks awesome, too. All right, well, let's drop a rune in this baby. What kind of rune? What kind of rune do we want to put in it? Superb cleansing. 50 damage versus the corrupt. I would like a dragon slaying one. I'd probably give it a really cool glow, but the two dragons I'm going after have a specific thing where they absolutely hate frost, so for now at least we're going to do the smart thing here and use a frost rune. Ooh, pretty. I like it. At 337 DPS too, it's definitely nothing to scoff at. Pretty damn good. Um, so, real quick, we are going to remove the upgrades from this before we sell it. Sell all the other junk, and I guess that wraps us up. We're done. Sell all. Excellent. Alright, guys. Well, either way... Up next, we are going to go take on the Hissing Wastes, the final area that I haven't gone to yet. Like I said, I know there is at least one dragon over there, so I can't wait to whoop its ass. And then after that dragon, and well, maybe even before we finish the Hissing Wastes, once we approach 23, we're going to head back and take out the final dragon. So we got a couple dragons left to go, one whole area, and then from there on out, it's just uh, story stuff when we're wrapped up. So either way, make sure to stay tuned, and we'll catch you guys next time with more Dragon Age Inquisition.